If you're like me and you have all these neglected projects around, um, something I've always had a problem on on these old cars is getting the bl brakes bled properly and, or even having a friend to help you do it. Who has friends, especially as you age, uh, let alone ones that you want to hit? Brake. Hold it. Okay, release. Not fun. If you're like me and you have no friends and you'd uh, rather be working on your cars by yourself, get yourself one of these. This is a Four Uncles vacuum brake bleeder. This hooks up to your air compressor right here. Has this nozzle to turn the pressure up or off, up or down. Has uh, this suppressor to quiet it. Has this quick disconnect right here to put in the various attachments comes it just hooks look at right there right on to your uh you know uh, air bleeder nozzle and it also has all kinds of different attachments um different ones for different air nozzles different um quick disconnects this one will also use it it's also a good idea this will suck the air out of your master cylinder so you can get all that nasty old fluid out my truck up there has old nasty fluid I should drain out and do a flush on have all these different connectors and all these tubes and join you know and different for different size air valves etc so you can see look how easy this is boom disconnect that disconnect this and oh this is the coolest make sure you never run out of um, new brake fluid this clamps on to your master cylinder right here see the clamp you open up your master cylinder, put the valve on low, fill this bottle up with brake fluid so you can just keep flushing it. You can add some more, like a little rabbit feeder, but for your brakes, really cool stuff. So let's check out how all this works. All right, so you can see it's right here. You got this hose, put this in. see it it's hard to tell but it, it drained all of this it drained it in there you can hear it in there <laughs> Could, couldn't even tell it's doing it but you can see that is lower so that's good to go then you go ahead and put this on here as such and then you have this valve and you can easily add in your brake fluid after you're done. Um, pretty cool system, and I hope this video helps you with your buying decision. You can see here I have the brake bleeder hooked to the compressor, and going over uh, to the bleeder, it's very easy to put in with the quick disconnect, have a wrench on there, and what you wanna do is just watch for bubbles. And turn And it works really well um, yeah and overall another thing I like this holds three liters of fluid and it's perfectly sealed you have to unscrew it to get the fluid out it's not gonna leak anywhere I had a different one that leaked everywhere and it was a pain with a portable compressor you can do this out in the field there's plenty of uh, juice just bring it with you and yeah this is a great product and I hope this video helps you with your buying decision